Hello guys, this is a quick demo to show you how I extended the media pipe hand tracking demo. So hand tracking is currently uh, seeing my face as a hand. So I, I, this is this is the, the real thing. So uh, I can track for one hand at the time at the moment. So later on, uh, maybe they uh, will update it for two hands. And it's running now uh, quite nice in the browser with a maximum of 61 frames per second. Quite, quite smoothly. So they, uh, in, in the demo from uh, MediaPipe, they also sh render a point cloud. And uh, that's shown below here. So this is, this is the translated uh, key points that can be used for displaying the hand in a 3D uh, scene. So that's what I that's what I did. I, I took this demo and added a 3D uh, scene with 3, 3JS. It's uh, down below here. This is one of the uh, examples from my uh, WebXR physics project. It's, it, it, it's just to catch the ball and to uh, to throw it yeah that works quite nicely i can uh, even uh, speed up the frame per seconds uh, by uh, disabling uh, the video here uh, i'm pausing the video here and i remove the point cloud and then let's see if there will be an uh, increase in the frame uh, rate yeah, it's 55, 56. Yeah, this, this is really nice. So this 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 is this demo will also run in WebXR. I will show you later on in a video uh, how that is running, and that's actually that's actually running with two hands and with uh, 90 frames per seconds. And uh, this is just for uh, to be able to to develop in the browser with one hand. Okay, that's it. That's it for the demo, guys. See you later.